Good afternoon. I'm glad that you could join us for prayer life at 1245 today. I am all dressed up for a funeral. Um, I got kind of an interesting outfit. I uh, don't normally wear these shoes. Let's see if I can show them. Um, got my Crocs on uh, just because those are easier to clean when I get back into uh, the house. But um, at any rate, I realized that I forgot to mention that uh, we were having a funeral today for a Karen Snow who um, passed away. I doubt that any of you know who she is, but uh, she has been an attender here at Lord of Life, part of the Lord of Life family. And I'll be meeting with the uh, family uh, over at Brenny Funeral Home, uh, keeping my uh, safe distance from them. But we hope to uh, send Karen off uh, well this day. And I thought for, um, well, I should also just mention that um, on Friday, I thought that the governor was possibly going to uh, uh, have us all shelter in place and going outside of uh, our homes would not be allowed. And so I uh, taped a whole bunch of uh, songs that I just sang one after the other, a uh, page through the hymnal and, and uh, found them. I don't know what uh, hymn will be uh, offered at the end of this, but uh, we'll pick something out and, uh, and have that be an offering for you. But I'd like to read um, some scripture that I intend to uh, use at this, um, at Karen's funeral. Um, it's a reading from John, the 14th chapter where Jesus says, Peace I leave with you. My peace I give to you. I do not give to you as the world gives. Do not let your hearts be troubled, and do not let them be afraid. Um, I think that uh, one great assurance that I have through all of this is that we are indeed in uh, God's hands. I don't personally know what uh, my fate is regarding this, uh, this um, pestilence, I guess you could say, that is, is uh, traveling through our world right now. Uh, but I do know that I am uh, Jesus, and I um, lean on my identity as a baptized child of God at this time. And uh, it is for that reason that I can draw a sense of peace even in the midst of uh, what is very uh, anxious times. And that doesn't mean I don't feel anxious. Uh, I mean, that would be a lie um, if I were to, to say that. But uh, I do think that when I'm drawn back to this truth and this promise that Jesus gives in my identity in Christ, um, I do feel a wave of peace that I'm very glad that I can access as, uh, as someone who uh, is a person of faith. I'd like to close with my favorite uh, prayer that is often used at funerals, um, and, um, and then maybe a song. Let us pray. O oh Lord, support us all the day long of this troubled life until the shadows lengthen and the evening comes and the busy world is hushed. The fever of life is over and our work is done. Then in your mercy, grant us a safe lodging and a holy rest and peace at the last. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. God bless you wherever you are. Shepherd, behold, God, beyond my wants, Beyond my fears, from death into life. Shepherd me, O oh God, beyond my wants, beyond my fears, from death into life. God is my shepherd, so nothing shall I want. I rest in the meadows of faithfulness and love. I walk by the quiet waters of peace. Shepherd.
shepherd me, O oh God, beyond my wants, beyond my fears, from death into life. Gladly you raise me and heal my weary soul. You lead me by pathways of righteousness and truth. My spirit shall sing the music of your name. Shepherd me, O oh God, beyond my wants, beyond my fears, from death into life. Though I should wander, 